Electric vehicles EVs, are currently experiencing a surge in popularity, with a growing demand worldwide. Sales of EVs are projected to skyrocket in the coming years, as they have revolutionized the automotive industry towards a greener future. Tesla has emerged as a prominent leader in this movement. However, it is important to recognize that the electric vehicle industry is still relatively young compared to traditional internal combustion engine IC, cars, and there are several uncertainties surrounding it. One of the advantages often marketed with EVs is their cost-effectiveness, as owners don't need to pay for gasoline. However, there is a hidden cost associated with owning electric vehicles that has become apparent, depreciation. Depreciation refers to the decline in value that a vehicle experiences over time. While depreciation is a natural aspect of owning any vehicle, it is crucial to understand its impact, especially when considering an electric vehicle. Depreciation may not be a significant concern if you plan to keep your EV for a decade or longer. However, if you intend to sell or upgrade your electric vehicle within five years, understanding the impact of depreciation becomes vital. Due to the rapid technological advancements and evolving market dynamics of electric cars, they often experience faster depreciation. This can be compared to owning an iPhone, where the prices of last year's models significantly drop when new and improved versions are released. Several factors contribute to EV depreciation, and some models experience higher depreciation rates than others. A study found that, on average, electric cars depreciated by 52% after 3 years, while ICE cars depreciated by 39.1% during the same period. However, Tesla vehicles tend to outperform the market and depreciate less than other electric cars, although they still depreciate faster than gasoline cars. Not all electric cars are created equal when it comes to retaining their value. Some brands and models fare better than others in terms of depreciation. For example, according to a recent article by a car dealer, the Hyundai Ioniq Electric, Renault Zoe, BMW i3, Nissan Leaf, Volkswagen e-Golf were among the 10 fastest depreciating electric cars after owning them for three years. In comparison, Tesla Model 3 depreciated the least at 10.2%, while Tesla Model X, Tesla Model S, and Tesla Model Y depreciated 33.9%, 36.3%, and 38.9%, respectively, over the same period. Battery degradation also plays a significant role in EV depreciation, as the performance and capacity of EV batteries tend to decline over time, affecting the overall value of the vehicle. It is worth noting that one of the contributing factors to EV depreciation is the incentives provided to new EV owners, such as federal tax credits. While these incentives aim to promote EV adoption, they can inadvertently reduce the resale value of EVs by a similar amount, contributing to overall depreciation. Tesla vehicles stand out in terms of holding their value well, and several factors contribute to this phenomenon. Tesla vehicles receive over-the-air updates, allowing them to receive software enhancements and new features without visiting a service center. This keeps them up to date with the latest technology, improving their performance and functionality over time. Additionally, Tesla vehicles often have a higher range compared to other electric cars. In conclusion, while electric vehicles offer numerous benefits, including environmental sustainability and potential cost savings on fuel, it is essential to consider the depreciation aspect. Factors such as technological advancements, battery degradation, and incentives can significantly impact the depreciation rates of electric cars. Tesla vehicles tend to depreciate less compared to other electric cars, but depreciation rates can still be higher than those of gasoline cars. Making informed decisions and considering long-term ownership plans can help mitigate the impact of depreciation when purchasing an electric vehicle. Electric cars have gained significant popularity in recent years, leading to a booming demand worldwide. Tesla has played a crucial role in driving the adoption of electric vehicles, thanks to its strong brand name and loyal fan base. However, the electric car market is becoming increasingly competitive, with new models and innovations constantly being introduced. This rapid evolution can quickly render older models outdated and less appealing to buyers. Additionally, 
consumer preferences and expectations vary, which can influence the demand and supply for different electric car models. As an electric car buyer or owner, it is important to do thorough research and comparisons before making a purchase. Factors such as features, performance, reliability, range, reviews, ratings, and projected resale value should be taken into account. Electric cars can be a great choice for those looking to save money on fuel costs and reduce emissions while enjoying a smooth and quiet ride. However, it is crucial to consider depreciation and its impact on your financial situation. Understanding the shocking truth about electric vehicle depreciation is essential for making informed decisions when buying or selling an electric car. To gain insights into the long-term depreciation trends, we can look at one of the first electric vehicles available to the mass public, the Tesla Model S. Since its introduction in 2012, the Model S has undergone several updates and improvements, including changes to its motor layout, battery capacity, software updates, and design. The latest version, introduced in June 2021, offers a tri-motor and all-wheel drive option, a battery capacity of over 100 kilowatt hours, and a range of 348 miles. While the starting price of the latest Model S is significant, the depreciation rate after three years is lower compared to other electric cars, standing at 36.3%. In comparison, let's consider the gas-powered Mustang. The latest version, released in March 2021, offers a competitive starting price, a 5.0-liter V8 engine, and various transmission options. The depreciation rate of the gas-powered Mustang after three years is higher than the average for sedans but lower than that of other electric cars. Based on these observations, electric vehicles tend to depreciate slightly more than gas-powered cars, both after three years and over a longer period. However, depreciation is an inevitable aspect of car ownership, and understanding and planning for it is essential. It is crucial to choose a vehicle that best suits your needs and financial circumstances, taking depreciation into account. If you are considering purchasing a new car, we would love to know if depreciation is a factor you consider. Share your thoughts in the comments, and if you found this information valuable, consider subscribing for future updates on the latest electric vehicle new.